All right, now in this little movie, I'm gonna show you how to set up the monitor arm and the monitor um, for an Optron. Let's take a look again at the parts and pieces that we have. We have uh, the uh, base clamp for the monitor arm, we have the middle piece for the monitor arm, and we have the front that actually holds the display. We have four thumb screws for the monitor, and we have one uh, wrench to adjust the tension up and down. Then we have the monitor. If you take a look at the monitor, um, most likely when you receive it from us, the base is already taken off. If you need to take off the base, the actual hinge and the base of the monitor um, on the HPs, we have three little screws here that you access through the back. Let's start with the monitor arm. I take the table clamp here, put that right here in the corner, and tighten that real well to that table to make sure that it cannot wobble. Next step, I put my middle piece just in there. Now when you put it in there, you want to make sure that that little black sleeve is in uh, the hole for that middle segment, otherwise your arm is going to wobble. And this is the third piece, goes in the same way up here, and you also want to make sure that the uh, uh, sleeve is back in here. Now, let's try something, trying to explain this for you here. Um, when you put the arm in, you can tilt the front plate. And you want to have it so that you have it turned away, the upper side, away from the side where you put the Optron on as much as possible. We have 90 degree possibility, either this way or that way. You want to make sure that it's turned as far away from the side where you attach the Optron later on. This is important to be able to put it on the portrait format. I'm going to take my front piece out again. And I put my monitor on a soft surface, face down. Make sure that the top of the monitor is facing away from me, the bottom of the monitor is facing towards me. Then I take my uh, monitor arm hinge, and the same thing here. This is the bottom, this is the top. Want to make sure the top points to top, bottom points to, pop to bottom. And then I take my four thumb screws and put them right in those four holes. Same thing here, you want to make sure that the screws are all in before you tighten them. Otherwise you might have trouble to get all the screws in the right way. Now with all four screws tight, I lift the arm here by its neck, take it up and put it carefully into the notch on the middle segment of the monitor arm. And we're good to go. Last step are the cables uh, that need to be connected to the monitor. We have a power cable and we have the monitor cable. The easiest way to put them in is if you tilt your monitor 90 degrees. You have a very nice access to the power here on the side and you have uh, just as easy access to the monitor connection up here. Um, I always make sure that the screws, at least one of them, is in on the monitor because later on it's going to hang down and they might loosen up otherwise. Um, in order to avoid a big cable mess hanging down from the monitor, it makes a lot of sense to take both wires and shove them right underneath into that little plastic sleeve on the middle on, on the front part of the monitor arm. If you just shove it up in the middle, you'll feel it goes very easy and it sits up there and all the wires are away from the table.